another feeding video for you. I'm sorry I keep doing vids on this snake. I just thought you'd be interested to see me eating. Um, I know you have already, but I didn't upload the other time. Yes, yeah, so I have been feeding him a lot, but this is a rat wiener now. So this will be his last one for at least seven days. So um, let's get it in. And there we go. And then... There we go. See you guys, as you can see, he took fine. Um, I don't know why he's... I didn't think he was going to eat that, but... I'm going to move all that out of the way while he's eating. Obviously got to wash my hands because I've just held the... Um, mouse, but... Yeah, let's get a nice shot. Poor rat. <laughs> So um, what I'm going to do is what I did last time, I'm going to pause the video and when he starts eating it I will resume recording. Alright guys, he still hasn't started devouring it yet. Um, the reason I've gone up to rat wieners is, let's see if I can get a shot of his eye, No, nah, you ain't going to get on there. Um, the reason I've gone up to rat wieners is because they are more fatty than mice. Um, so he will put weight on more with rat wieners than he would with a uh, jumbo mouse so that's why I've gone to them but um gosh you can see him breathing I don't think the camera picks it up oh yeah it does <laughs> but um yeah that'll be his last meal for a week uh, some people would say yes I'm overfeeding which maybe yes I am but again I didn't have it they didn't have any rat wieners in the shops so he was literally just having mice, um, which obviously weren't enough for him. So uh, I thought I got some ordered in. Um, got a big pack of five um, and five fuzzies for Harry the Hognose when he's finally shedded. Uh, while we're waiting for this, I'm going to take you over just so you can see him. Alright guys, he's literally over there. Uh, he's very, very defensive of this hide. Uh, as you can see, he's in blue. Oh god, let me focus. There we go. I mean, I'm not going to do it with my finger because I know he won't bite. I know it's a fake, but just so you can hear him. Oh, he might. Oh, there you go. So uh, I'm not going to annoy him too much, but um, I'm going to show you. He's probably hooded up like a cobra. Yep. There he is. He does not care when he's in blue, so I'll leave him alone. Uh, need to uh, give him a quick spray down as I don't want him getting stuck in shed. So I'll do that right now. Actually, while I've got, while I'm over here, uh, just my tarantula water sprayer. Uh, uh, I do spray quite a lot. I raise the humidity to about mm, I don't know 70. Um, and then I let it drop back down before I even bother spraying again. If I do it too much, it will be way too humid. I mean, the humidity gets out through them anyway. Sorry about the state of them, they're a bit rusted. But um, this is what my leaf insects were in. I don't know if I mentioned in the video when I got him, but I gave my uh, leaf insects to a pet shop uh, as I really wanted to use this for a snake anyway. Well, I, originally I was getting a... Uh, crested gecko but I thought why not get a hog nose I've been after one for over a year so I might as well so I check that's locked yep yeah, that's locked uh, any oh here we go <laughs> perfect timing actually I don't want to get too close with the scent of rat on my fingers I don't know if you guys want to watch it all, you'll probably get bored, so I'll probably cut it out soon. Um, and take a picture of him when he has eaten. As you can see, he's started eating now. Look at that jaw. Gosh. People make the mistake thinking snakes break their jaws to devour their food. That is not the case. They have um, like a tendon in their jaw. And it makes it um, like elasticated, so it can stretch um, over their food. 
They do not dislocate their jaw or anything. There he is. <laughs> a time lapse video but I've got nothing to stand my phone on. Uh, time lapse will be quite good. Uh, I don't have the equipment to turn it into a time lapse. But uh, there you go guys, that's him eating his first wrap with me. Like it is about the same size, no a little bit bigger than a jumbo mouse but as I said there's a lot more fat in them. So um you'll do well but anyway guys I'm gonna cut the video there because I don't really want to bore you all with the whole feeding thing if you would actually like to see a whole feeding I mean it will be boring but if there's anyone that actually wants to see that and I get enough people say they want to see that I will do one but I will warn you it will be quite boring um, I'm gonna see if I can figure out how to do a time-lapse uh, stand my phone up but um, yeah guys so thanks for watching and I hope you like the video.